Hi, my angel fairies. I hope you guys are having an amazing, gorgeous, abundant day. In today's video, it's going to be a little diet centered if you already read the fucking title, which I know you did. How else are you going to click on this? But basically, your girl is going on a plant based diet. And not diet in the sense that I want to lose weight. Diet in the sense that I've been eating like shit. It's time to fucking get this shit together. Like, I've been wanting to do this for so long. Literally months. But I haven't had the discipline to actually take action towards, you know, changing my diet to kind of suit me and help me be, like, feel good as well as, you know, tastes good because right now I eat for pleasure I love it food is so fucking awesome and the things that I eat I know is not making me feel good and it doesn't make my gut feel good it doesn't make you know my heart feel good so I'm kind of like over you know just eating to feel good no just eating to taste good but I also want to feel good as well so I think going plant-based is definitely for me I kind of want to try that lifestyle so I can feel happier my gut can be a little bit happier because the food I've been eating is shit, y'all. Like, it, it's, it's shit food. I cannot even deny it. So, like, I think, what, last week, every single day, all I ate was Popeyes, which Popeyes is so good, don't get me wrong. But, whew, no. So, I'm over that. So, for a plant base, I'm still going to eat seafood. Um, I'm still going to eat eggs and like, um, turkey bacon from time to time. I'll, um, the things that I'm really cutting out is big, like red meat, which is like chicken and beef and, uh, basically those things. I'm still going to do eat cheese because I fucking love cheese until I find like a really nice vegan cheese that I like, then I'm good. I'm Gucci, but vegan cheese be hits a minute. You can kiss my head. Like, I don't, I'm i don't give a fuck so so i'm kind of excited for this new journey that i'm finna embark on because it's going to be awesome i know i'm going to start feeling really really good because that's exactly that's basically what i want for going plant-based is just to feel good when i eat certain things so i just don't want to eat and it just tastes good and then afterwards i just feel so overstuffed and over full and just bleh and I, I'm, I'm over that feeling so yeah this is going to be fun i'm going to take you guys along with me going grocery shopping i asked trinity to take me grocery shopping because she's either plant-based or vegan and she's going to help me um get some stuff and you know start that journey and then i'm also going to show you guys the meals that i cook so i can hold myself accountable and you guys can get some inspiration if you're trying to do this as well so yeah let's get this shit started right now it's like only one something about to be two i'm e editing today's youtube video and it's gonna come out. Um, this video is gonna be going going up next week. So the video that I'm editing right now is already up. If you guys wanna be a Dewey legend for the summer, tap into it. And then after that, I'm just going to be like answering emails, getting my shit together. Um, because I woke up a little bit late. I'm kind of excited because I'm all, I also been slacking on my routine because I've been really practicing staying in the present and not worrying about time which is awesome. I freaking love it. I'm not really, I'm just like drifting through life, you know, it's fun. Love it. Um, but I kind of want to get back on track. I kind of want to wake back up at 6 a.m. again, go to sleep early again, and then still don't worry about time, you know, stay, still be being in the present moment. So I'm going to teach, I think I may tell you guys how I do that in this video. Um, if it do come up but yeah and i'm also going to be like doing a whole new right night it's like me getting my shit together just basically all around this is a video of me getting my shit together okay come along with me for the ride so i'm going to see you guys when i go pick up trinity so we can go grocery shopping we're going to go to trader joe's and we're going to go to kroger's and i've never been to trader joe's before so this shit is going to be fucking fun i hope you i'm excited i'm excited <laughs> This is a very vegan of me, not gonna lie to you. She's got vegan. called out. These are vegan, no, these are vegan. <laughs> she eats the classic Lay's. Don't know how I feel about that. I'm feeling a little bit betrayed a little bitch bit. Bitch, you eat KFC. <laughs> and I'll do it Shut again. The fuck out. <laughs> but not anymore, because why? Why, guys? We are plant-based. That's why we're not doing this anymore. Mm -hmm. We are at the local Trader Joe's. We're finna go in here, we're finna get the shits. Let's do this.
So I'm home um, from the grocery shopping and I wanna show you guys what I got. Fun fact, my period decided to come on today. Ew, so what I'm going to do, it didn't come on yet, it's just, you know, you know, it's at that period like, yeah, bitch, I'm here, but I'm not here. So I'm gonna hit this fucking bowl, I'm gonna smoke this fucking weed until I can't for the next five days because I'm taking some ibuprofen and I don't wanna mix that shit, so. But yeah, let me show you guys what I got. This is what I basically got from Trader Joe's. Um, I got some tissue because, you know, I needed it. I got some strawberries, some cantaloupes. I got some spinach, um, some bell peppers and cucumber because um, I'm gonna make a veggie rice bowl at some point this week. I got some cheese because I wanted to eat this with my strawberries and kiwi because I think it'll taste really good. And I have some hash browns. I got some maple agave syrup blend. I'm gonna let you guys know how this tastes. Um, Cause I'm not a really big maple syrup fan. I got some marinara sauce because I have been craving spaghetti and I may eat that for dinner tonight because like vegan spaghetti, I should say. Because like I just want it. And then I got some American orange chicken. This is vegan. I wonder how this is going to taste. It's gonna, I'm gonna make this with some fried rice tomorrow. But I don't know just yet. And then I have some oat milk, some spaghetti noodles. Um, that's pretty much it for Trader Joe's. And then I went to Kroger's because Trader Joe's and I didn't have what I want. I wanted to try this meal that is called, it's a salmon avocado toast. So I got some pre-sliced ready to eat salmon. I'm so excited to fucking see how this fucking tastes like. I'm gonna eat this tomorrow guys. Woo! I'm excited, bitch! All right. Okay, I'm gonna have two of these tomorrow. Uh, and then I got some kombucha because you can never go wrong with kombucha. This is my favorite brand. It's from Simple Truths Organics. I got raspberry hibiscus. And then I also have raspberry lemon ginger. These are my favorite flavors. I tried the blueberry ginger. I liked it when I first tried it. But then once I tried it again, I, I was not feeling it. So that's that. Um, I got some Beyond Meat, be Beyond Beef, um, ground. You fucking lying. But I got some like vegan or plant-based ground meat. Uh, I'm excited to try this as well. I think I'm gonna leave this out because I think I'm going to make some spaghetti tonight. So I'm gonna leave this out to the fall. Um, of course I got some ibuprofen and then I just got some produce i got some broccoli because i'm thinking about making some um stir fry or something this week and then some lettuce and the cucumber and then i got some bread some toast it's brioche um thankfully it can fit in my toaster but yeah i got this from sprouts it smells so good it smells like beyond sweet i'm excited to try this with tomorrow's salmon um one slice is 170 calories. So I think I'm going to eat two of these bitches even though I don't ca count my calories. But I'm eat two of them tomorrow. And I am very excited to, I'm, ex I'm very excited for breakfast tomorrow. Like breakfast is my favorite fucking meal of the day. Serving it up Gary's way, bop. So I'm just gonna put these up and if I do eat dinner tonight, I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I ate. Let's get into it. Hi guys, so I made an error. A slight blunder. Hold on, let me go this way because I'm wearing something and I don't have panties on. So. <laughs> I smoked, right? And now I'm so high, I don't think I'm gonna be able to make what I want to make. So what I think I'm going to do is have my breakfast a little bit early today. And then, oh shit, this is dirty. And then roll like that. So no spaghetti today. <laughs> See, that's why I should have cooked. I didn't know I was gonna still be high. <laughs> All right. So, okay. I'm gonna come back after I make it, yay. <laughs> hey y'all, so now I'm sober. <laughs> 
I made that little salmon shit, but it was not. No, it was good. It was it was good. The way it looked it though. Mm -mm. The salmon is not ripe. So, <laughs> and I was high as fuck. So I didn't give a fuck that I had to chew my, no, not the salmon, the avocado. The avocado wasn't ripe. And I didn't give a fuck because I'm high. So I didn't care if I had to chew my food. I was just hungry. So now I'm coming down from my high and I said I was going to make spaghetti, but that avocado got my stomach kind of So what I think I'm going to make is a beef fajita, a, veg a vegan beef fajita. Um, I don't know if I, it really depends. It really depends on how I am because at a certain time, I don't want to cook, but I want to eat something because I'm going to wake up like hungry and I really have to pee right now. So let me just go <laughs> Good morning, I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. Today is now Tuesday and I'm making breakfast. Oh yeah, I'm out of breath. I just got finished dancing, you know, tapping into some morning serendipity, some morning happiness, but I'm gonna make me some salmon avocado toast using this bread here. Like I said, I'm going plant-based, I'm not going vegan. So let's keep it cute. So I'm gonna have two pieces of bread, two pieces of that. But I'm also gonna have some lemon ginger tea with it. I always have this in the morning for the past couple of month, weeks. And it's so good because it helps with my bloating in the morning and it makes my stomach feel so good. So if you're looking for a drink in the morning that is really nice on your stomach, I'm sorry, <laughs> my laundry's showing. That's really nice on your stomach. I highly recommend lemon ginger tea with honey. It's so fucking good, but yeah, let's get to it. I also went to Kroger's this morning and got some avocados because like I said last night, um, the avocados that I had were um, not ripe. They was hard as fuck and I was high as hell eating that shit, <laughs> but it was good, it was okay. But now since I'm gonna have ripe avocados, I know this shit finna hit. It tasted like I was eating ham, but healthy. And I don't even like ham. We're gonna see how it tastes since I'm sober now. I know that shit was hitting when I was high, but I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts on it. Okay, anyways, let me just cook this shit. guys i just woke up from my nap and i'm finna have a snack <sighs> for the snack today i'm thinking of like either a fruit bowl or like a fruit and cheese plate okay okay <laughs> Hi y'all. For lunch today, I think I'm going to have some orange chicken with some fried rice. But I desire, as one should say, I desire desperately some chicken to pull, some chipotle. Like I want that chicken quesadilla I had, but I'm not going to get it. Why? We are embarking on this new journey. This sounds like I'm convincing myself and I am. That's exactly why I got on this fucking camera. So y'all see that I ain't doing that shit. I am sticking to the plan. It's so beautiful today. Let me show you guys. You can see it's really beautiful out there. But like, this is my window and it like literally, them trees just be blocking the sun. 
Girl, I be wanting to sunbathe my pussy and I can't because of the trees. I just finished my lunch and it was good. It tasted exactly like chicken, exactly like orange chicken. 10 out of 10, we'll get it again. I'm so fucking full now. I couldn't even all, eat it all. Damn. Hey, y'all. So, um, I'm back with my hair. Ah. Um, now I'm finna to make some lunch. Wait, no, some dinner. Actually, not lunch. Um, I'm going to make some dinner, and it's going to be, like, the, the spaghetti thing that I talk about. So, hopefully it's good. I never really make dinner. So, uh, I don't know. And I'm on my period as well. I feel flat. And the eclipse is tomorrow. Girl, I'm just getting punched left to right. So having it, going through an eclipse on my period. Like, what the fuck is that? But, and it's the full moon. Oh my fucking God. Oh my God. <laughs> but, all right, let's go eat this. I'm going to be using the Beyond Beef Meat, I think it's called. I think that's what it's called. So I'm going to use that. I'm going to let you guys know how it tastes. I do like the beef crumbles. I do like it. So... Hopefully I make the spaghetti correctly. Hey y'all, today is Thursday. Right now it's like 720 something. And I just got back from the gym and from working, no, from the grocery store. Um, Cause I wanted some new shit. Last night I was craving bagels. I wanted my fucking bagels. So I came and got some, and I also wanted some chips and some broccoli cheddar soup. I was craving that as well, so I got that. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. First thing I got was some mango lemonade. This is my favorite one simply because it's very low calorie and it tastes so good. It doesn't taste like overly sweet. And I'm trying to kind of, you know, cut down on my sugar, like the way I intake sugar, my sugar intake, basically. And this is like still good, but not overly sweet. It tastes like juice, but it's lemonade. Tastes like not overly sweet lemonade. Then I got some chips. I got sun chips and Lay's kettle corn. That shit's so good, y'all. Um, and then I also got, you know what the fuck I was supposed to get? Sesame seeds. Oh, I'm tired of myself. Okay, anyways, I forgot it. Anyways, I got the broccoli cheese soup. Hopefully it's good, like as good as the Panera one. If not, I'm going to try it. And then I got hot Italian Beyond sausage uh, meat. Um, I'm being with all this. If this shit nasty, y'all, I'm a riot. And, and that's not a threat. That's a fucking promise. I will fucking throw this shit off over my balcony if it's not good. Because this was $8.99. And yes, we abundant. But also, don't play with me. Don't be nasty. Like, come on now. So, I'm going to let you guys know. I think I'm going to have this for lunch. So, I'm going to let you guys know how it tastes during lunch. And then for dinner, I'm going to have a vegetable rice bowl. That I am excited for because I've been saying I was going to have it for the past couple of days and I lied. But <laughs> and of course, you need bread. So, you got the hot dog buns for that. And then I got the cinnamon bagels. I really love cinnamon bagels. I even get this or the everything seasoning type bagel shit. Like, I forgot what it's called. But yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. This is all I'm getting. Now I'm going to take a shower because the poos, the pussy stank, okay? The cooch is coochin'. Hello? If you discuss my hair in the comments, you're anti-black and you're racist. But anyway, that sausage was heaven fucking sent. Do y'all like my bed? By the way, I got, I finally got my bed. Er, it's the mom um bed from ikea and then i also got some nightstands i don't know if i like the nightstands i'm gonna finish my room 
and see what I'm gonna do then. I think I want the nightstands to be a little bit shorter. Let me guys, let me know what you guys think. It grew on me for sure, but I would love to have your ideas. But anyways, yes, the sausage was amazing. Come on beyond me. I'm not eating beef again. Like what the fuck? Now I'm excited to try their hamburgers. I, 10 out of 10 y'all, that shit tastes exactly like a fucking hot Italian sausage. It is worth the $8 I got, for sure. For fucking sure. Oh my God, it was so good. Hi guys, so it is the end of the video. I'm just closing it out because right now I'm actually editing it. I forgot to close it out, so I'm just closing it out right now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope it kinda, you know, Gave a little insight into my life. I am so excited for the content that's going to be coming in June. A lot of downloads are coming in for me during this Mercury Retrograde. So I hope y'all Mercury Retrograde goes smoothly. And thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see my angel fairies next time. Bye my loves.